Hi, and welcome to our Flexive tutorial on exporting a design. Today, we're going to be teaching you about publishing designs, about export options in Flexitive and naming conventions, and about the different export file formats, including HTML5, video, GIF, static JPEG, and static PDF. Publishing a design. Before you export your Flexitive design, you'll first need to publish the design. This is different from saving the design. Saving the design will save it only in the preview page and in the editor for your design. Publishing the design will update the design on any live URLs that you're using to view the design, any tags that you've exported, or any iframes that you've exported. It will also update the design whenever it's been used as a global asset in another Flexitive design. Clicking publish on the right hand side of the editor will publish the design, which will then remove the modal. Export options and naming conventions. When exporting from Flexitive, you'll have the option of a variety of different file formats to choose from, including HTML5, animated GIFs, videos, and static images. Static images can be exported either as a PDF or as a JPEG. This wide variety of options for file format makes Flexitive the perfect tool for creating omnichannel designs. Flexitive also creates designs that can be used for a variety of different platforms, including platforms for social media, display advertising, digital signage, email marketing, and your website content. All files exported from Flexitive will use a naming convention. The standard naming convention in Flexitive is to use the design title, the platform that it was exported for, and a timestamp. On an enterprise plan, you can change this to use any of the fields, including title, description, and custom identifier. Or you can even use the channel, country, language fields or even custom field one or custom field two. Any information filled in in these fields will then be pulled into the naming convention when you export. Exporting HTML5. When exporting your designs for HTML5, you'll have the option to either export the design for an ad server or DSP, or you can export for a CMS. In either case, you'll have the option to choose between offline files or live file exports. With offline files, you can set the back of image quality or the image asset quality to whatever value you'd like. By default, the values will be 95%. You can also then choose an ad server or DSP from this dropdown. For the sake of demonstration in this video, we'll use Google Campaign Manager 360. You can then set your images to export at two times size, embed web fonts, add a one pixel border, or place your backup image in the zip. Flexitive designs can contain unlimited numbers of sizes, so you can choose as many of those as you'd like when exporting. In this case, we'll export all of them and then click Download Zip. After clicking Download Zip, Flexitive will work to put together a zip file that contains each individual size that you chose to export. Images and text will be optimized to their lowest possible file size without sacrificing image quality. In addition to exporting for HTML5 as an offline file, you can also export for a live file. To do so, switch to the Live File tab, choose a ad server or DSP from the dropdown, we'll stick with TCM, and then you can choose to either export MRAID tags or add a one pixel border, and then once again, select your sizes you'd like to export. Exporting videos. When exporting in a video MP4 file from Flexitive, you'll always receive an offline MP4 file. Before exporting, you can choose to add a one pixel border and then select the size you'd like to export for. The video length will be set based on the animation length of the design. In this case, it's 5.25 seconds. You can check that by opening the animation panel and checking the total time. You can click MP download MP4 in order to create that MP4 file, complete with all of your animations and audio from the design. Exporting GIFs. Exporting a GIF file will always be provided to you as an offline GIF file. You can choose to set a one pixel border, then select the size you'd like to export. The GIF length will be set based on the animation duration, which you can check by opening the animation panel. When you open the export panel and hit download file, Flexitive will put together a GIF file of your design, including all of the animations set to infinitely loop. Exporting static JPEGs. Static JPEG exports in Flexitive will always be exported as offline files. By default, the static image quality will be set to 95%, but you can change it if you'd like. 
You can also choose to export the design with two time size images or add a one pixel border. Choose as many sizes you'd like to export and then click download file to get your static image export. The exported file will be a zip containing JPEG exports of every size in your design. Exporting static PDFs. In Flexitive, static PDF exports are always provided as offline files. The static image quality will be set to 95% by default, which you can change. The dots per inch or DPI will be set to 300 and will determine the physical size of your design. You can choose to export as two time size images, add a one pixel border, then choose as many sizes as you'd like to export. Clicking download file will put together a single zip file containing a PDF version of each of the sizes you chose to export. Thanks for watching our video. If you found it helpful, please like and share this video and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials. If you have any questions, you can email us at support at Thanks again so much for watching and have a great day.